record this and uh, you can see as we are recording the equipment is taking measurements uh, uh, at different depth intervals uh, it goes to a maximum depth of uh, 300 meters on the ground and then uh, as it takes measurements it's going to give uh, uh, these uh, uh, graphs so the graphs are the ones that we are going to interpret and see where we can uh, get groundwater um, and the basic sense is that uh, so now we are going to shift the props uh, to one meter uh, okay and we make sure that the props are uh, tightly uh, penetrated the uh, soil and then we continue with the measurement so as we continue recording we will uh, move Further towards uh, the west at intervals of uh, one meter, and we will have uh, different readings. And at the end, um, the equipment will give us a profile, uh, which is uh, depth versus uh, the length. And uh, in that profile, that is where we are going to see uh, where we are going to get sufficient uh, groundwater. Action. We are most probably uh, implies that we may have uh, something like a. A detachment or a fault line and it's, this section has been uh, uh, down faulted and this is uh, up, up, up wapping so uh, in in this section we have placed proposed the best point for drilling being this uh, point number 18 